not shake the camera. Hello, it's me, Jessica. I'm back again. I know it's been a while since I've done a video. It's actually been a few months. But I decided to do a video today after all this time. Um, the wig that I'm going to do today, this is going to be a pretty short video. The wig I'm doing today is by um, Magic Weave. It's from the Central Collection. And this is the wig right here. And it is called Cairo Girl. Okay? And... But actually, not, what am I saying? It's not Cairo Girl. It's called Miss Cairo. And um, the color that I have today is a F1B33. I've already taken it out of the package. I just ordered it from um, a, we a website called hairwigharlem.com. I paid like $13.99 for it. And this is how she looks. So it's a nice kind of, you know, loose curl wig. And... Um, it's got adjustable straps that I've already adjusted and um, I've already prepped my hair um, I actually permed my hair this morning but I only permed the edges and um, I took this size curling iron and curled my hair and um, now I'm going to put the wig in so all I did this morning like I said um I permed my edges. I didn't perm my whole head. I only permed the front of my head. And I just trying to like not over process my hair these days. And um, I blue dried out. I put a little um, CPR hair moisturizer by Motions. And I curled the front and that's it. So now I'm going to put on the wig. So I've already tied this part of my hair back into a little ponytail. Home to the front, <clears throat> and I'm going to put her in. Um, she's got some big teeth. This is actually my first time trying her on. But you know what? I'm going to have to adjust the straps again. I think I made the straps a little bit too tight. So I'm going to adjust it a little bit. So when I bought this wig, I was actually going to buy um, Alice, which if you've seen my video before, that was the first wig I bought. And I saw somebody else do this wig on YouTube, so I decided to get it. Alright, this feels a little bit more better. Okay, even though some people like, you don't really need to have your wig as tight as possible because it can become uncomfortable. Okay, so I put her in and I'm really liking the colors. The FB130 is 33. It's basically like a number two with like um, reddish auburn highlights in it. And now I'm gonna take my hair pins and pin the sides. Even though really, the way it feels right now, you really don't have to because it feels pretty secure, but I'm just going to stick it in anyway. And now I'm going to just take my wide tooth comb and comb in my um And comb my hair into it. Now the person that I saw do the, this video, they didn't um they said that you really didn't have to curl, you could just bump it a little bit. But I just decided to um a little bit. Okay. And this is pretty much it. And the last thing I'm going to do, um, I have, this is a, a new gel that I haven't really used. I just started using probably about a month ago. Um, usually I use QP Glaze. If you see my mother videos, you'll see I always use QP Glaze. But um, I saw, I, I do watch my friends with my lover's video and I noticed that she um, uses the black and sassy. And so I started using it. And I actually like it a lot. 
so I think this might be my new thing. I know it seems like I'm kind of rushing this video, but I'm actually on my way to a baby shower, so I'm just trying to move pretty quickly. If I think it, I'll shoot a quick, quick video just because it's been a long time. And this is pretty much it. Um, you can, if you want to, you can pretty much just leave it like this. Um, I'm not going to put a head out. Oh, you can put a headband if you want to, but I'm going to just leave mine like this. Right now I'm, doing, I'm just picking out some of the hairs because sometimes your natural hair can um, get stuck in the wig line. So I'm just all right and this is it real quick and easy took me all about five minutes i'm gonna just leave it like this so this is the front and let me show you the back okay. and this is it okay so quick video anyway um please stay tuned because i will be doing some other videos i've ordered some last some other brand new weeks that i haven't even tried on yet and i'll be doing videos on that also so thanks for watching and please um subscribe rate and comment Hey YouTube, what's going on? Um, it's me, Jessica. Um, the main reason I made this quick little video is because you just watched um, my Miss Cairo tutorial and I just wanted to give you guys a quick little update on Miss Cairo. That video was actually made um, back in September. Um, it's now end of November and I'm just now getting it, you know, made or whatever. But I just decided to make this quick little video letting you know about um, Miss Cairo. Um, it is a nice wig as you can see, but would I suggest to, um, buy this wig? Probably not. If you, it's, like I say, it's a very beautiful wig. If you don't mind wearing it and not really have, for more than a couple of days, for not more than a couple of days, then fine. But if you're looking for a wig that actually is going to last, then I really would not m waste my time for Miss Cairo. I never had a wig that tangled up so badly within a, a probably three days the back of it was just tangled so horribly to the point where you could actually see it through the wig. You know, sometimes when a wig tangles up you can kind of hide it. With this thing, no. It tangled up really horribly and it only lasted like a few days. And um like I said, it's one of those wigs that's just nice for three, four days, and then after that, it's of no use to it, use to you, and you have to pretty much toss it. So, um, I, even though I liked it, I probably would not purchase it again. Um, if you want to take a chance with it, it, it is cheap. It was $13 and change, but it really wasn't even um, worth my time anyway. And if you're in, if you're curious, the wig I have on right now is by Alfie. It's called Jessica, and I'm going to make a video on that. Uh, make a wig tutorial on that video at a later date but I just wanted to update you guys on Miss Cairo. Miss Cairo tangles up really badly. It looks really crappy after a couple of days so it's really not even worth the $13. There's too many other wigs out there that you can get that are nice that, could, that you could get to look similar to Miss Cairo that will last you a lot longer. So anyway thank you for watching my video and I'll see you next time. Bye.